on them popping. The curls is popping though. Ooh, my pin. And now I'm about to put it on, put this wig on. I'm going to define the curls, blow dry, and see what all I could do with it. So right now, that's what I'm about to do. I'm about to take these out. This is a crochet that I did in another video, which will be on my page pretty soon if you're watching this one. And um, yeah. Hey y'all, so right now what I'm doing is just basically taking out the crochet out of my hair and then we're about to place this easy yet very nice headband wig over my braid down pattern that I already have. So I hope you guys enjoy this video and you know just stay along the way because your girl actually finessed this wig. At first I wasn't feeling it and now I am feeling it. Pictures on my IG. Okay, so I'm just about done getting all the crochet out of my hair. And then what I'm going to do after this, you know, it looking good, looking good. Y'all did just hear somebody text me or whatever. But um, I'm about to just basically flatten my hair out and put it in my wig cap. Yes, usually when you buy a wig or receive wigs, they do come with wig caps already. But they're usually the brown color. And for most of the times, I would recommend a black cap when you have a headband wig just because... A black cap will fit better with your black hair under the wig and I feel like that's just uh, self-explanatory so then the next thing that I'm gonna do is actually put on this wig it is very easy to put on low manipulation you know what I'm trying to say all you got to do is put the wig on insert the, the combs in the back front and side of your hair and yeah that look a little crusty right there just because I had some gel on it because I do wear these wigs before I actually put them on camera Simply just because I want y'all to know that I actually mess with the brand before I'm just putting stuff out. This one I was a little skeptical about because when I seen it, when I put it on like right now, like right when I'm putting it on right now, I was like, OMG, who mama, who auntie is this? Like, did you bring the color greens, girl? Like, did you, did you bring them? Did you bring them? I don't know what exactly I was saying, but it was definitely giving me angry black woman with this hairstyle. And yeah, we just gonna stop right there. Fix it to your head because yeah. And then in the back, all you wanna do is just fold it on like that. And we on in popping. And we on there popping. All right, so now what I'm about to do to this wig, I said I was gonna come back and define it. So that is what I'm going to do. What you need is a water bottle, okay? You do need a water bottle. So you need a water bottle, a Denman brush, and maybe like a light conditioner with this. I don't know why it just cut out like that. But um, yeah, and then what I do with this hair is I first spray some water on it, detangle it with a brush I would prefer a Denman brush but I couldn't find mine so I just use a paddle brush and then after that I'm going to apply some of the cream or conditioner onto my hair and then after I do that I am going to move on to finger coiling these curls that's what's going to make the curls very defined very you know detailed and it's going to give it that really pretty look that we're going for and basically that is all and then after that i have to blow dry it and pick it if you don't do these steps with this hair and you get this hair i promise you it's not going to look like this you do have to take some time to actually take care of it 
style it in a way so it could look at its best. It didn't come like this out of the box. So this is what we're looking at right here, right now. As the hair is coming a little bit together, I can say, I can say, just slightly is coming together, looking a little better. Um, next thing that I'm gonna do after I have defined the curls with some water and conditioner, I am going to go in with a diffuser attachment, a diffuser attachment, and diffuse dry the curls so they could be dry and then I'm gonna pick it out. So that's what I'm about to do. That is basically done with that. And now I'm about to go pick this hair and I'm gonna come back with the final, final look with the headband on and everything for you guys. And I hopefully you like this video. So this is the final look of the hair after it is blow dried, defined, picked out some. I mean, I could, I could, it's gonna get bigger with the day when the days go on, but I feel like this is actually kind of cute it's kind of cute like at first i was like not feeling it too much but now that i got it together it's really cute um this hair whatever that beeping noise is needs to stop okay but um what i wanted to say is that the hair curl pattern is similar to my natural hair only thing is my natural hair is all the way down to my you know under boob and yeah, I feel like it's like a 3C. It's very high premium fibers, I could say, or it's natural hair. I feel like it's natural, natural hair. Like it feels like natural, natural hair and it's curly. It's even curly at the roots, which is a thing that's kind of weird sometimes when you get like units and stuff like that, they're not curly at the root, but this one is really curly. It's giving me very much natural. Like, it looks like my natural hair, in my opinion. It looks very natural to me. And I feel like if you like it, ooh. If you like this unit, you know, you could get it. Everything's linked down in my bio. This one is 14 inches. I feel like that's the longest that this uh, hair can go. And the only con that I, sh I can say about it is the way that it's cut. Um, for me specifically, I don't like hair that's cut like this. I would want it to be a full circle. This one's kind of like longer at the top and shorter at the bottom, I believe. Or maybe it's just all one length, 14 inches all the way around. So at the bottom, it looks kind of shorter than the top. I don't know. It looks cute, but um, that's the only thing bad about it. I like longer units, but this thing is kind of cute. And it's not hot. You know what I'm trying to say? It's not giving me... I'm going to be sweating on my shoulders and stuff like that. So yeah, this is what I look like with it and if you want to see the curls a little more closer because i did finger coil them that's what they're looking like yeah if y'all want some pictures please follow me on my instagram